calls it hang loose welcome to mongoose max hawaii the <laughs> okay uh it's uh july 7th and once again in a rush mm, it's sunday so old and new a little bit old and new yeah but uh before we uh, <laughs> Have trouble with the God first thing because so there's so much fun. But anyways, why rush? Because there's a birthday party today, and I gotta take my mom to the birthday party and be there at the birthday party, and it's the party of my sister's daughter's daughter. So that means one year old birthday party, and I I guess I'm great uncle <laughs> no time for being old but uh yeah great uncle and birthday birthday uh one years old i mean jeez uh i i can't even remember being one years old i mean if you think back in your earliest memory i think there was something like there's three there's three there's three. I remember three. I remember maybe there's a couple of splash memories of four, or five years, four to five years old. Two. Mm, Screen. Nah, can't claim two. One. Let me show you. <laughs> no. So I guess I'll take a camera in case of prosperity outlives me and I'm no longer on this earth because of I'm not one years old and time goes on. <laughs> I'll take pictures. Look, this is great time to take a picture of you back when they had these antique little things called digital cameras. I took black and white photographs in high school, developed a film in black and white, made black and white photograph. Color is too hard. But I did film and actually developed film. I mean, film. I wouldn't go back to film. <laughs> Expensive. Too much work. Why? What am I talking about? Old and new. There's a little bit of news. Battle. Let's do God first. It's a battle. It's a battle between good and evil in this world. We need a little bit of this. So, it's ready this time. In nominus dear Patre, Flinius Spiritus Sancti. Vini Sancti Spiritus, Vini Sancti Spiritus, Vini Sancti Spiritus. Yes, a little out of the Old Testament, random, and random out of the New Testament with rubric, red letters, Jesus words. Old, First Kings looks like, Second Kings 1724, Assyria resettles Samaria. The king of Assyria brought people from Babylon, Chutha, Ava, Hamath, and Sepharvar. Aim, and placed them in the cities of Samaria in the place of the people of Israel. They took possession of Samaria and settled in its cities. When they first settled there, it did not. They did not worship the Lord. Therefore, the Lord sent lions among them, which killed some of them. It smells. <laughs> so the king of Syria was told, "The nations that you have carried away." And placed in the cities of Samaria do not know the laws of the God of the land. Therefore, he has sent lions among them. And they are killing them because they do not know the law of the God of the land. Okay, thank you, God. Oh, uh, leave what else? Oh, no comment. Now, new. No. Has to be, um... John, uh, 1244, the summary of Jesus' teachings. <laughs> oh gosh, okay. 44, then Jesus cried aloud, whoever, <clears throat> whoever believes in me, believes not in me, but in him who sent me. And whoever sees me, sees him who sent me. I have come as light into the world, so that everyone who believes in me should remain not in darkness. 
I do not judge anyone who hears my words and does not keep them, for I came not to judge the world, but to save the world. The one who rejects me and does not receive my word has a judge. On the last day, the word that I have spoken will serve as judge. For I have not spoken on my own, but the Father who sent me has himself given me a commandment about what to say and what to speak. And I know that his commandment is eternal what year is it? life. What I speak, therefore, I speak just as the Father has told me. Thank you, Jesus. Brandon? Oh, all of a sudden ghost block. I should have turned you I should have turned you off. <laughs> Just gonna read a little bit out of there. So yeah, one year old birthday party. Oh gosh. I, I, no recollection at one year. There's not there's not gonna be any recall there. The brain doesn't completely fall. It's, it's just beginning to expand. It's like after two years old, there's an expansion. And then you start getting those little long So, yeah, in the world, everybody's going, oh, that debate. That poor performance at the debate. Nice. And now, the campaigning is so intense that it's like hinging and focusing everything on that debate, which opens the door. This guy is too old and he cannot continue and they're getting pressure from even the Democrats and sponsors and and, and vibes just like going, I'm going to do it. I'm going to go and I'm going to beat that guy. And I applaud him and I, I wish him the best and I'm going to be like, yeah, go for it. Because basically there is no, if they had a legit person to say, Here's an alternative runner to beat Trump. They don't. And the Republicans don't have anybody else but Trump. Their whole focus is Trump is going to win. And that's why they're on board with Trump. Because they simply, it's simply down to win this thing at all costs. Lower your voice. And so, uh, yeah, that's, that's the scary part now. So, um... Yeah, uh, uh, I don't know. It's like, uh, it's Hello. hinges. Like, I, I, I can't think about it too much. I <laughs> can Anyways, uh, it's time for, uh, I want to leave. Yeah, you're talkative. Hawaii, Hawaii's got news too. Let's go look at Hawaii. Okay, yeah. Agency overhaul. Yeah, there's a study about Hawaii tourism with, they want, there's a Hawaii Tourist Association. And a study says, weak. We, they're weak. That's correct. And they want a new type of governance to maintain and enhance Isle's distinctive attributes. This is this is because they have a they have big budget and they want it. So Hawaii Tourism Authority, it's like they're handling the big budget and they want somebody else to hand it over to. So it's like, ooh, uh, Taylor, this guy. Um, Party boy into Paris bound Olympian. <laughs> oh gosh, what's this guy? It's here. Never seen this story before. So let's get going on. And there it is. Feed the kittens. Feed the kittens. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> Nothing wrong here. Just feeding kittens. Green science bills to enhance disaster preparation response. Keeping cool. It's getting hot over here. Fourth of July includes two young. We're splashed by the incoming wave. Look, the wave, it splashed me with water. I mean, you bring an ocean. No, that's what people do. They stay, hang out in the wind and the sun, and it gets too hot, and they go in the ocean. There. Done. Oh, okay, here we go. Tailor made. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> it's like, oh my gosh. Okay, why is Taylor party boy? He is what? Um. Party boy from college volleyball star to Paris bound. So he's volleyball. I'm volleyball. volleyball. Uh, so he's uh, being dismissed from men's volleyball team at UC Irvine ahead of his freshman university somewhere in Canada. This party boy could not have, but finally bottomed out, and then he was back in Hawaii, and he's just like the so. 
so basically, yeah, he's just parting out, and the, and the schools that he's going to are sort of like suspending him and everything. He's volleyball. What do you think? It's volleyball, guys. Come on, party on. Okay, party on, right? Volleyball. Uh, a little back in the day, please. From back in the day, 1978, when you want to relax, just go out there and do the cha-cha. Yes, we're doing the cha-cha. Cha-cha-cha. Tango? What is this? Jimmy Wong and his wife perform a party hula during gathering of old-time entertainers. Boat Day Musicians Oaks Club in Waikiki. Long 34 time. He also worked as a beach... I was once a beach boy. Now I do the... Dingo, whatever that is. Okay, okay, yeah, okay. That was nice. Okay, that was, uh, yeah, that's really easy, easy there. Oh, party tour in France because that's where the um, Olympics are, right? Sometime. Oh, band roll. Oh, and here we go. Yeah, Roe versus Wade. So Biden's going to bring back um, the right for abortion, Roe versus Wade, and um, Trump's going to systematically. Um, abolish it across the nation, making it illegal. Even P-O-R-N, which I can't say on YouTube, <laughs> is going to be abolished and he's going to have, oh gosh. Possessed. Yeah, everything's going to be illegal because he wants the Christian nationalism. Oh, let's go. A little cartoon. Here we go. Move George Orwell's 1984 to nonfiction. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Project 2025, yeah. There's Project 2025 in the works, and Trump goes, Oh, no, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Stressed. Yeah, stress. It's a do or die. And so, here we go. And another one, just to keep this, keep it real. U.S. oligarchs to rise if Trump is elected. If Donald Trump becomes president, his rule will mirror Russia's. Vladimir Putin has a total control and maintains his power because he allows oligarchs to monopolize businesses with reward of extreme riches. Courts that bow to his every wish and complete control of the media and education, which are inundated by false propaganda. It is blatantly obvious the US Supreme Court is leaning to authoritarianism. Expanded presidential, presidential. Okay, okay. Expanded presidential. Nobody understands. Yeah, because it's hyphenated. That's why presidential immunity is dangerous because new president under someone like Trump. But more concerning is the recent deregulation agenda. This will feed a new breed of oligarchs, unbounded by regulations for banking and finance, human rights, and the environment, with the net result being a massive transfer of wealth Andrea. to the top 1%. Mm -hmm. The oligarchs can easily hire an army of thugs mm -hmm. with Supreme Court author authorized bump stocks stationed along their palace walls to keep the serfs at bay, yelling down, let down me kick. Patrick Caldwell Kailua. Yes, thank you, Patrick, for your um, astute observation there. Mm hmm. Absolutely. That's actually <laughs> Lucy <laughs> Toby. Marie Antoinette. Revolt. Oh, let them eat cake. Oligarchs. Oligarchs are like the. It's like if everybody. I can't speak. Mm, you're going to tell you. If the like, thing. Super, super wealthy, like aristocracy. Super, super wealthy, in our case and they were the ruling class you know that's that's what you get all your rules from the oligarchs that's oligarchy and russia's got it uh america has it infiltrating but you know corporations they lobby and they get their way and they deregulate and they pollute your streams and everyone's coming up with three-headed cancerous fish <laughs> but the company's big corporation making much money and all that goes to the one percent everybody else is like Pfft. and that secret police or not even secret is this going to be like uh that's how it's done and all that's going to come to pass if we prove it so, and it's like so, so, so freaking. just vote for anyone but him go go 
just every, everything Democrat. Anyways, um, um, yeah, that's it. Even if I was 100% Republican, I'd be like, um, not this time around. <laughs> okay, uh, aloha, I gotta go. Aloha to you, aloha, look, it's Sunday, I gotta go. One year old, I gotta go for the party. Let's do that. Oh, don't call me that man. That's a bad name. Oh, shouldn't talk like that. It's impossible. Aloha, just say aloha. Aloha to you, aloha, bye now.